This is the third video in the Holy Trinity of GH6 and we'll be taking a long look at its 6K capabilities, or to be more precise, 5.8K. The exact resolution is 5760 by 4320, which means that it's vertically speaking 8K and horizontally it is 5.8K. And if we were to use an anamorphic lens 1.33 times like Sirui or something else and we squeeze it on an 8K timeline, we would get 8K video out of GH6, which is absolutely bonkers if you take into account its price. In any case, every single frame is 24 megapixels, which makes this footage insanely demanding to edit. You're either gonna film in H.265 and use low res proxy files, or you're gonna film using ProRes. Difference in timeline performance between H.265 and ProRes is, as expected, night and day. But at the same time, ProRes eats a lot of space and you cannot film in 4x3 aspect ratio, you can only film in 17x9. I don't know why, but that's just the way it is. When filming in higher resolutions such as 6, 8, 12K, we need to use lenses that can actually resolve that amount of detail. But this is kind of a shitty advice because there is no metric to go by. Well, there technically is line pairs per millimeter, but it is not really but it is not really declared on the box of new lenses. So we just need to test the lenses and see which one do the best job for these resolutions. Most of this video was filmed by Mir 3B 65mm f3.5 medium format lens and I already did a video on it. Anyhow, enough rambling, enjoy the footage and watch it in 8K if you can.
Thank you.